My name is Colby Carrier. I'm a mission operations engineer with Andrel. And right here behind me, we're in Marfa, Texas. We're putting up uh, Marfa Border Patrol Station's first tower. Uh, this is an autonomous sentry tower. This is the largest sector on the southern border for Border Patrol, but they have some of the smallest Border Patrol stations uh, in the country. This station has about 113 miles of river border to take care of, 111 of the 517 that the Big Bend sector has. So we're deploying a tower here in a urban to urban area. These towers are gonna bring a lot of situational awareness and enable them to work much more efficiently in this border zone. So usually we'll ship the equipment out, we put it on a few trucks, and a team will install this tower in a few hours. It is solar powered, you can see the panels on the front. It's completely green technology. And what's unique about this tower is that they require zero infrastructure. It just sits on top of the soil and it's weighed down by ballast. That's different than legacy technology that requires infrastructure like concrete or they're drilling into the ground. And that's very valuable for us because it allows us to put towers in wildlife areas that other towers are not allowed to be because you disturb the environment or on private landowner property. 90% of the, the land around here is owned by private property owners and, and in this part of the world, in the Big Bend country, uh, private property rights are very, very important to those landowners. The engineers are able to go into the software and input exclusion zones and we can put those on if a rancher has their house out here and they, hey, I'll let you put a tower here but I don't want you to look at my ranch. We can exclude his area. And so what these do is it allows Border Patrol to draw polygons on the map to tell the tower, don't look there. The Lattice software platform is the core of everything that Andrel does. The idea is that you have an unlimited amount of sensors that can integrate into this platform and you have one common operating picture. These towers operate 24-7, 365. Agents are freed up to go to the field. And so when the tower identifies something that it's looking for, in this case, we're looking for people who should be in the area, when it sees something that is worth surfacing, it will send notifications to an agent at the station who has it up in their background where they're completing other tasks or to their phones, their TAC phones or their government cell phones with a notification showing them exactly what they're looking at, the exact coordinates of where they need to go and what the people are doing right now. Without this technology, no way we could have the situational awareness that we will with these towers in place. By giving Border Patrol information, full domain awareness, wherever these towers are, they can then utilize their manpower resources or any other technology they have more effectively uh, to accomplish their mission.